wait, wait, wait. Okay, immediately I, I announced the, the thing in... Oh, my stream bit rate is dropping. Oh, that's fun. Uh, oh, wait, actually, I need to send my Wi-Fi settings. Hold on. Sorry, I I announced that I'm going live, and uh, Mind Planet wanted to look at a thing. Or wanted me to look at a thing, and I, I, I can't really show it, but I'm gonna play the audio. It's just images of Pepsi. Oh my god. Uh, wait, uh, yeah, sorry, I'm, my, my Wi-Fi is a little bit screwy at the moment, so sorry if the stream is like 144p right now. It, uh, it should be better now, wait. I don't know, it's, it's been, it's been a little bit weird. I've had to like, like, disconnect from it and then reconnect from it and such. It's, 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 it's very, uh, it's very messy, but hopefully it should be stable now. Sorry, uh, uh, I'll go, I'll go, I'll go back to, uh, 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 uh shush. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm, wait. Uh, hello, uh, is the music loud? The music loud on my end. Wait. I always ask if the music is loud. Is the music loud? Uh, I've been playing PC Engine music, which the console was like brought up on a stream a few streams ago. Uh, the fucking Haru brought it up because it was it was it, it, like the PC Engine mini. I just I didn't think about it. Like I just put this music on because it kept being recommended to me. It's like a 15 hour mix of of PC Engine music. But like it took me until now to so realize that it's PC Engine music. <laughs> I'm maybe a little bit. I don't know. I'm a little bit tired at the moment, honestly. Um. Uh, it's been a bit of a day because I, I I went out to watch this movie and uh, my sleep schedule hasn't really been like the greatest lately. So I had to be up early. And it was like whoa, like ooh ah. Uh, like I, I feel I feel a little bit tired, but I had a good time though. Uh, the Mario the Mario movie happened. Uh, I'm gonna I'm probably gonna talk about it, but I'm also just gonna play this game. Uh, I mean this is like this is like the the I just watched the Mario movie, so I'm probably gonna talk about it. Story. Where am I? Uh oh. Uh. Oh. Uh, uh, haha, <laughs> don't worry about that. Uh, uh, where? Oh, oh, there I, uh, holy sh, holy fuck. <laughs> Seth Rogen. <laughs> what the hell? No, fucking Seth Rogen. Oh god, jeez. Oh no. Okay. So, I watched the Mario movie. I guess now I have uh, someone to talk to about it. Uh, Haru, you've also yeah. seen the Mario movie. You watched it like the, the second that it came out, right? Yeah, I'm also going to see it again this Sunday. Yeah, okay. Uh, fucking, it's amazing, right? It's like such a good yeah. movie, right? Like, it's I, like. I I've had minor problems with it, but it's still like a really good movie. Yeah, like it's way better than I was expecting, at least. Which is like saying a lot, because it's a fucking it's a it's an Illumination movie, but it's also the Super Mario Brothers movie. And it's like Illumination has good movies. A lot of their newest stuff hasn't been good. Yeah, I mean they they have like one good movie, and it's like the first Despicable Me movie. The sequel and like to a point also like Minions too. Nah, I don't know. It's I mean okay. Uh, to put it this way, the Mario movie is definitely their best movie, like by far. Uh, 
Yeah, no, I, I would also say that. Yeah, uh, it's it's very it. like it's it's hard to say that like any of their other movies are any better because it's it, it's like Mario Despicable Me one and maybe like The Grinch or The Lorax, but it depends on how I'm feeling. <laughs> I mean, I don't, I don't really have much of a stance on a lot of Illuminations movies, but it's just nice to know that they didn't mess it up uh, and like make a make a big mess of it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna play this game, by the way. Uh, I'm, I'm playing, I'm playing the the Mario Three uh, e-reader levels because they included it in this in in the GDA thing. Uh, yeah. I wonder if I should keep this screen filter. I, 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 I always have it on. It's like one of my favorites. So yeah, it's just better. Like a, it makes it is a look. yeah. I do like it, but it's like maybe for the stream isn't right. I don't know. Because I mean, like already, like it's not even just the bit right. Like the the capture card that I'm using is like freaking out because of it. But I don't know. Uh, I'm trying to think. It's like yeah. It's my like we have a problem. This movie's kind of the pacing, but like it's it's whatever. It's like it's a would be a like, yeah. pick up and watch situation. Yeah, it's 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 a very like fast paced movie, but I think they also just wanted to pack a lot into it. Uh oh, wait, how do I do the e reader thing? Uh, you gotta play up until a certain point within the game, if I if I'm correct. Really? Oh shit. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure how far you gotta. Uh, oh no. Oh wait, wait. Level cards. Oh, level cards. Oh. Right. Uh, okay. I will say this is. I'm probably gonna turn the screen filter off because it is very bright. Uh. And just like, I don't know, like, I'm, I'm looking at, like, a pretty big screen right now. Uh, as I'm playing this. So having a screen filter is, like, maybe not the greatest. It also doesn't help that, like, these games are blindingly bright. <laughs> yeah, I mean, they definitely, like, corrected the colors a little bit, but it was just with the screen filter, it's like, it looks even brighter, and it's like, oh, oh, oh. Yeah, it's also like... for those dimly lit screens of the original Game Boy advances. Yeah. Um... But I mean, like, didn't they correct it for some games, though, on here? No. It's like, some games had options for it back in the day, but that was kind of about it. Really? Because, like, I thought for, like, a couple of games they may have changed it, but I don't even know. Uh, where are the levels? So, okay, uh, so I'm playing as Chris Pratt, right? Uh, that's so Charlie that, Day. The one right before the castle, like, that glowing spot there. Oh, this. Oh, yeah. uh, right. Uh, Classic World 1-1. One, one. Whoa. There's a lot of levels, uh... It's a whole new game, basically. Yeah, it's crazy. It's so weird that they made this and then they made it exclusive to the fucking e-reader. Yeah, I mean, like, they were trying to sell the e-reader back then. Yeah, but like... What? Oh yeah, we have Chris Pratt, uh, voice acting. In he this wasn't game. that bad. In but, this game. <laughs> in this game, yeah, he goes, uh, it's a me. Wow, just what I needed. Like, uh, those early trailers for the Mario movie did not make Pratt look yeah. any good. No, I was, like, I was viscerally upset, like, realizing that the, the edits that they made in the trailers made it seem even more awkward than it actually is in the movie. Because, like, the movie, it's, like, still, like, the voice acting is, like, whatever, but the, the, the trailers, like, were edited in a way where it's, like, oh. Yeah, they're using early takes oh. or early drafts or something. Yeah, I don't... I don't know what the hell happened. It's just like, they, they made some decisions and like, they, they cut parts out of scenes to make them seem faster paced. And it's just like, why? Mushroom Kingdom, here we come! Even the part, like, at the beginning, where it's like, they, they showed the whole scene in that Nintendo Direct. It's like, not even the whole scene, like, there's more of it in the movie. Yeah, and then it goes into the... the ad which she showed off a while back. The what? The, the, the Super Mario plumbing ad where it goes, Super oh, yeah, Mario yeah, yeah, yeah. or something. Yeah. I don't know, it was a good movie. I, just, I kind of forgot what I was even going to say about it. It's just like... I, I liked it. It's apparently doing really well as well. It's like, it's 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 projected to get like 
300 million dollars or something. Yeah, I guess you have the Japanese critics to say about it. I, I, somebody I follow was talking about it earlier, it's like... Uh, it, it's not very popular among Japanese critics. Really? Yeah. I mean, it also isn't popular amongst English critics either. Like, I've seen some pretty scathing reviews and it's like, okay... No, what do you expect from a fucking Mario movie? Yeah, it's like... Uh, it's good if you're a fan of Mario. I just realized I'm not using the 4x3 layout. I should probably... Uh, wait, oops. Wait, uh-oh. Sorry. Hello. Um... Yeah, it's like, it's a good movie if you're a Mario fan. Like, not really, not much else really matters. It's like, it's a really good movie if you like Mario. It's an okay movie if you don't care about Mario or the references. Yeah, like, I can't imagine enjoying it if if you don't care about the references. It's like, it, it, it feels like, I guess, it's like, it's, it's similar to how, like, um... There's a bunch of movies that just have, like, a bunch of things in them as, like, background pieces, and it's like, oh, it's like a reference, like, if you see it and yeah. you get it, then it's like, whoa, that's cool. But, like, a lot yeah, of those Ready movies... Player One? Yeah, like, I was about to say, it's, like, usually stuff that's, like, multiple franch- fuck. It's, like, usually multiple franchises in the same movie, but with Mario, it's just Mario stuff, so it's, like, at least it's a little bit more targeted. <laughs> It's also Nintendo stuff in general. Yeah, like, there's some other Nintendo stuff. Uh, like, uh, there's fucking, like, the, the Punch-Out Pizzeria, and, like, uh... What was uh, the, 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 uh... Kid Icarus? Yeah, Ki oh yeah, he plays Kid Icarus. Fuck, what's the, uh, Wrecking Crew? Yeah, I mean, the Wrecking Crew is part of the Mario universe. Technically, I guess, yeah. I mean, it is now. It's always um, been the situation, but like it's been yeah. a lot more recently, with especially as how the movie is. Yeah. Um. One thing I noticed, like towards the end of the movie, is that in in the background you can see a sign for Disc Coon from the yeah. fucking Firecon Disc Reader, and that that was really cool. What was it? Uh, there was a sunshine like uh, there, yeah, sunshine a uh, travel law uh, agency. Oh. Like, right beside Punch Out uh, Pizza. Damn. Yeah, there's what just like it? a lot of like background references, and it's like, oh, it's neat. Mario it's, like, also did a Mario also had an F Zero poster in the back, if I if I remember correctly. Uh, yeah, it was in his room. I think I because I, I, I didn't obviously. I mean, because the actual movie is like fast paced, you don't really get like the chance to look at it closely. But uh, I got like an email about it, like, oh, the Mario movie is out now. And it had a screenshot of like his room, and I noticed that he had a fucking R wing from Star yeah. Fox just like on top of his TV, and I didn't notice that while I was watching the movie. And it's like okay. Uh, I, I was looking like every, I was looking around every second I got within that movie. Yeah, it's definitely a lot to look at. Uh, uh, but... I, I can't wait for the uh, Blu-ray the release in a couple yeah. months. I can do a deep dive with that. Mm. I saw, like, I, I was, like, looking up images, because I posted on Twitter earlier that I watched it, because I'm doing a media thread, so I was looking for images for it, uh, and I, 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 like, there was a result of, like, the Blu-ray, but it was being sold by Warner Bros, like, on their store, and I don't know why, because, like, they have no involvement in the movie. Like uh, I think it's parent company situation. Is it though? Like, do they own Universal? Uh, hold on, let, let, let me look this up now. Cause that's like, I don't know, that's like all over the place. At the very least, like, why would they, why, why would they be selling it on the Warner Brothers store? Like, even if it's the same company, like what? <laughs> Okay, it seems like they, they kind of they, they ain't like proper family situation, but they use the same disputes like the, the the same companies that like ship out Blu-rays and everything. Right. I mean, okay, that makes a little bit more sense. It's just still like what. <laughs> Check 
I can't really get that Walmart exclusive Mario Blue, uh, for Ultra HD 10, I believe it's what it's called. Walmart exclusive. I am gonna get it on Blu ray when it's like available. Yeah, also, <laughs> you got Luigi, thank you. I, I, I love what? that part of the movie. You, you know, when Luigi says you got Luigi. Oh, yeah, he just says you got Luigi. Like, I, because I, they, they posted that as like a promotional thing. Uh, and I thought it was like, oh, it's like a meme, it's like, aha, you just got Luigi to repost this to totally Luigi your friends. But no, he just says it in the movie. <laughs> uh, I posted the, the cool, like, exclusive limited edition pin in the chat. Oh, wait, in the chat, wait, oh. Uh, oh, my god, there's a big plastic star. A uh, big I, tin star. I, I wanna get it. Oh, it's in the star. The disc is. Oh shit. Oh. Yeah. Well. Oh. I mean, I wouldn't get that because, like, how are you gonna fit that on a shelf and not have it like look weird? But I, 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 I have a bunch of shelves and spaces around my room, so. Yeah, I mean, I don't like. I I have like a stack of Blu-rays and a stack of like a, a DVDs and Blu-rays. Uh, kind of, kind of. Hmm? I, I, I have all my Blu-rays in my dresser what? at the moment. Yeah. Oh my god. My, of... Sorry, my, my stream bit rate is like going all over the place. I don't know what's going on. Uh... Oh. Oh. Well, I was disconnected from this other. Oh. oh. What? Hello. Oh. Sorry. My my internet is being really screwy at the moment. I don't know what's going on. I, uh, I think it's I think it's a Twitch thing, maybe. No, because like Discord is being affected as well. Mm. It's, uh, it's like you're not acting up on my end situation. Oh, but yeah, but I mean you're acting up on my end. I don't know. It's, something's going on. Uh, it's my it's my stream even going like it says my bitrate <laughs> no. is zero. I, oh, it, it's showing the 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 error screen at the moment. Oh. Lost connection. Oh, no, no, now it's back. Oh, well, okay. All right. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, it's 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 been a little bit messy. Uh, but whatever. Um. Uh. Oh. Yeah. Uh. Super duper goddamn Mario. He, he, he really went, it's a me. Yeah, he really, really went, it's a me. Uh, I'm trying to think about like what even happened in the movie. I, I, just, I really like how they handled it, though. Like, I, it was not bad. Like, I, I don't know, I liked it. <laughs> I, I really want more spin-off stuff now. Yeah, uh, like the- because like they kind of seemed like very um reserved with what they did in the movie. Like it feels like they want to do more but they're kind of like keeping it limited for the first movie so just set things up. Yeah, it's, it's uh, kind of how the Sonic movie was to a point. Yeah, I, I didn't watch the Sonic movie but I can imagine it's like a similar thing. Because like they even did like the reveal at the end of like oh my god Yoshi is gonna be in the next one. <laughs> I guess. Yeah, it's like, the, the Sonic movies are really good. Oh. I mean, the second one, it's like, I would put the Mario movie above Sonic 1. Yeah. I've, I've heard that uh, the Sonic movie is like, not as good as, as the Mario movie, but I don't... Uh, I Sonic can't movie judge, two. personally. Sonic movie 2 is like, I think one of my favorite video game movies. Yeah. You know what? Uh... I watched, like, a week ago, oh shit, you know what I watched, uh, last week that also came out is the fucking Tetris Ooh. movie. I- I started to watch that. It's- it's pretty fun, I don't know, like, I- it's yeah. not- Yeah. It's- I- I kind of feel the same way about it, like, I do with the Mario movie, where it's like, it's a fun movie, it's not, like, amazing, like, critics aren't gonna love it, but it's like, it's fun to watch, I- I don't have a problem with it. Yeah, I, I've been meaning to, I haven't been watching a lot of movies recently outside of, uh, Mario. Yeah, um, it's also on Apple TV, like, you kinda have to pirate it to watch it, yeah. unless you actually bother with Apple TV. 
I don't I don't have a single Apple device in my house. Yeah, me neither. I mean I have I too I had oh, iTunes on my PC. Me yeah. for some reason, what is it? Uh who's the company behind Sonic? Uh Paramount is only doing like, you, you know you know you know how Blu-rays come with uh, codes for digital uh versions of the movies? Yeah. So Paramount is just doing only Apple products now? Wait, why? What do you mean? Yeah, so I so they give you a code that's like, oh, use this code on Google, uh, the Google Play Store or the Apple, or the iTunes Store to get this movie for your library. Yeah. And now it's only ever the iTunes Store. Oh, <laughs> that's gross. Yeah, and you know, I don't have any Apple device in my house, and it's like I want to have Sonic Two on my phone. So yeah. I have to go spend maybe the extra twenty bucks to go buy it on my phone. I mean, you know, I like, I like <laughs> well, the I mean, There is also piracy. I, I mean, it's also like I own two copies of the movie, so yeah, I'm you're, fine like you're fine. Piracy. Yeah, like, but it, 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 it's this thing that's like they did it, it. It's a recent thing they started doing for some reason. I, I, I have Sonic one of my phones, yeah. you know, the code, but it's like I'd like to have just both movies on my phone so I can watch it kind of whenever without having to delete it in a way. I mean, like, just the, the whole kind of, like, realm of, like, modern media releases, holy shit. The, uh, like, modern movie releases on, like, Blu-ray, it's just completely alien to me, because I haven't really gotten any that are, like, very recent. Um, I, I, I'm picky on my Blu-ray releases at this point. Yeah. But also, it's like, I don't know, like, the most recent thing, oh shit. The most recent movie that I have on, uh, physical media is, nope. Like the the Jordan Peele movie, and yeah. I got that in like a like a bundle pack, and it's like it, it it doesn't really like make a big deal out of it because it's a DVD bundle thing, uh, so it doesn't have any digital codes or whatever. So I just don't know how that stuff goes. Yeah, it's also like I, I buy movies and like <laughs> for watch them at this point. I, I, yeah, it, it's something I can't stop doing. It's like. <laughs> I, I, every time I, I go to Costco, I'm like, oh, cool, a movie I, I want to watch, but I haven't watched it. So I, I, I bought Parasite and Joker on Blu-ray right. at, at Costco. Yeah. I've yet to watch both of them. Yeah, I kind of do that a lot as well, though. Like, I'll, I'll buy a movie and be like, wow, it's really cool that I have this on physical now, and I just don't watch it. But it's yeah. usually also movies that I've seen already, so I guess I'm fine with that. Yeah, it's like, if I'm buying Blu-rays, it's stuff where I came out. So it's, it's which is why I have, like, Three copies of Sonic One on Blu-ray. Well, uh, although I have like one Blu-ray copy of Detective Pikachu, which is funny. Being a Pokemon one? fan, yeah, oh. despite being the Pokemon fan, wow. I have one Blu-ray of that movie. I mean, it's not really a great movie. Uh, it's it's I don't it's know, okay. I don't remember it, it, enjoying it too much. Yeah, it's also I feel like you gotta kind of be a fan. Yeah, for a that's part. probably why. Uh, oh. This level is like kicking my ass, by the way. It's beating my ass in the quote retweets. Wait, it's like. Oh, what the it's hell? I'm, I'm gonna have to buy a second copy of the Pikachu. I wanna have each movie in Japanese and English for the Pokemon movies. Because for a lot of those early Pokemon movies, have two different soundtracks. Oh, I mean, that's like a valid reason, but with a lot of movies, it's just like the novelty of having the Japanese dub. Yeah, and it's oh. like... But I also like Pokemon movies. Yeah, I yeah. them anyways. It, oh. <laughs> oh, I thought there was war there. I wasn't paying attention. I'm a little sloppy at this game at the moment, because I'm tired. Yeah, let's... Tired, let's go. <laughs> yeah, woohoo. I, I woke up like... A couple of hours ago, which uh, is been a lot, but I'm always tired yeah, after I wake up. I mean, I got like the longest time. I got up a while ago, but I also didn't get much sleep, so I'm feeling a little bit like woo. Yeah, it was I'm pretty much the same. It was worth it for seeing a uh, fucking kid Icarus for the NES on the big screen. I, I am I'm the world's biggest kid Icarus fan. Yeah, <laughs> I, I love. I love the first two games, and I guess Uprising. You guess Uprising. I I, I love the, the classic uh, side-scrolling platformer ones a whole bunch. You like them more than Uprising, though. Like that's crazy. 
I've never heard anyone I, say that. It's it's also kind of been forever since I've last played Uprising. Yeah, I've never played it though. I've never actually like sat down and properly played any of the oh shit. I've never sat down and like actually properly played the Kid Icarus games. Uh, there are a lot of like it, it's it's a grind fest. Uh, yeah, for, like the first two games. I mean, like I've seen the first Kid Icarus game, but I'm mainly talking like I would like to play Uprising. Like I think I would probably enjoy that game. Uprising is like one of the best 3DS games. Yeah. It's like the only problem to it is kind of the controls, but it's something you can get used to. Yeah. Um. It it, it ain't no Star Fox Zero. But in a good way. Star Fox Zero's controls are kind of awful, and it takes forever yeah. like, for the game to click for you. While it's like, uh, Kid Icarus slowly builds you into how it plays. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I also uh, I've never played Star Fox Zero either. You ain't missing much. Yeah, I know. <laughs> uh, well, I gotta like it's 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 really funny that there's a bunch of just like really mid tier Nintendo games that everybody dunks on. Yeah. Uh, uh. Like, I don't know, like, Chibi Robo uh, Ziplash is, like, pretty bad. Like, I didn't enjoy playing that game for, like, the five minutes that I played it. I, uh. I, I had to buy myself a copy at some point. Or, it's, whenever I see Brady, I'd be like, hey man, can, can I borrow this for a moment to play? God. I mean, why though? <laughs> so, uh, I want to try it out. Is the situation? I mean, you could try it out by modding your 3DS and downloading it through that. No, but I, I want to support the indie company. That's Nintendo. Oh, uh, right. Yeah, I see. I got it. I got it. I want to support an uh, indie company, Nintendo, making. Th th you know, they're only making three million, th no, three hundred million dollars on their new movie. Yeah, uh, I mean, it's in the like, first they're, opening they're, days. The, the Japanese version, I believe, is also like decently cheap, so I'm like, eh, I don't mind. Yeah, okay. I'm not surprised uh, I, I it's decently check. cheap. But it, it ain't no, uh, uh, was it? Uh, Rhythm Heaven Mega Mix is a game I need to pick up, but it's still expensive oh, in Japan. shit. I mean, that's just like expensive everywhere, right? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, damn. The same as uh, Kirby Robo Planet is another fuck? expensive one. The goddamn the plants, the the things from Mario to the vegetables. Oh, turnips. Yeah, turnips. Like there's just like a whole heap of stuff going on right now. I kind of didn't uh, think about it. <laughs> like this is not but, Mario Three. <laughs> yeah, they they they're fucking around with the 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 engine. I guess. Yeah, and the, the e-reader cards, it, it's a mix of the, kind of all the games. Yeah, oh. Oh, damn, I thought that would have something in it. Uh. it wow. Uh, so I was saying this to my friends, but it's like, I, I want a punch-out movie now, or TV show. I... Honestly, I don't know what... Uh, like, I don't know what they would do next that would work adequately. Because, like, they could just do a direct sequel, but in terms of, like, getting other series as movies. Yeah. Like, what, like, I don't know what they could do as a movie. I feel like Kid Icarus could probably work as a movie. Maybe, but, like, would people know what Kid Icarus is? Like the, it's it's kind of more about like like how many people would actually go to see this and how likely is it that they would actually do it. it, it it's a chance. You know, a lot of their chances. It helps me like brings in the spotlight to a lesser known franchise too. I suppose, but I I, I, I don't know. It would just be like it wouldn't get the same audience. Wait. It's like, it's sort of like I, I feel like Punch-Out would probably work best as a like TV show short thing. Yeah, 
I mean, I don't even know, like... Like, I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know what See? they would do. Oh. With Punch Out, you could have, like, each episode kind of be a match against somebody. Yeah. I mean, well, okay, there's, like, a lot that could be done, but, like, realistically, I honestly think that they're just gonna keep doing Mario movies. Because, I, like, I don't know how else they would do it with, uh, with other series. I'm kind of just saying a lot of the same stuff right now, I'm very tired. I mean, I mean Nintendo always finds a way to do something. Yeah. I mean, they are gonna do more, like, there's no way that they're not, that, that they're not gonna, like, make more movies, because it's making, like, a bajillion million trillion dollars right now. Yeah, Mario Sweep. Mario Sweep. Wait, like, what the hell? This guy... Just like, even just a Kid Icarus anime piece, that, that has worked in the past. Yeah, I, I mean, because like, okay, I was fucking thinking about like, if they did like a Zelda adaptation, how would they do that? It's... It depends on what story they kind of want to tell for a Zelda thing. Yeah. Because, like, an anthology series would really work for it, but then how would they release that? Like, what would that be on? Uh, I'm, I'm trying to think. It's like, I, I can see them doing, like, a... depends on what story they want to tell. I can see a, like, trilogy movie thing working. Uh, I, uh... I mean, no, 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 I was, I was thinking, like, a TV series. It's like, how would yeah. they distribute that? Because a lot of, like, streaming services are, like, it's like not many people have Netflix, but then it's like, Disney has, like, a really high standard, and it's like, I don't know. I, I feel like it would be a Netflix thing. Yeah, I guess. It's just hard to say. Or it's like, oh, you know, we can go to Paramount Plus or uh, HBO Max. God, yeah, wow, they, they really could do that. Or, or my favorite platform, Quibi. Oh, fucking Quibi. <laughs> Mario, Kid Icarus original Quibi. <laughs> Quib Icarus. Uh, I've been thinking about playing Kid Icarus on stream or some other stuff I normally don't ever play. Yeah. I don't really know what I'm doing with my stream at the moment. I kind of just want to, like chill out and play games that I like, because it, I, I, like, I haven't really been doing that. Like, a lot of my streams over the past year have been, like, playing a new game that I've never played before. Mine has been playing the same games for over a year. Yeah. Like, I think I'm answering my playing the same game for over a year territory. I... I'm, I'm, I'm trying to think about my longest. It's gonna be uh, Splatoon, most likely. I mean, that, that is longest episode-wise. I think yeah. it's probably same with uh, just length in general. So I've, I've been playing every event that has happened. Yeah. Um, I think my longest episode-wise was Ocarina of Time, and I, I didn't even really enjoy doing that. I, I am 27 episodes into Splatoon. Damn. Is that like every Splatoon game, or is it just Splatoon 3? Just 3. Oh my gosh. If you, if you wanted to count the series Road to Splatoon 3, that's like Ugh. 11 and a half episodes. Gosh. Oh, no, no, that is, oh, I think that is straight 12 episodes. Man. Yeah, I don't know, my Ocarina of Time thing was like 11 streams or something. Pokemon uh, Violet's gonna probably gonna be like the second longest. Hmm. Uh, may maybe Tears of the Kingdom, depends on how much I play that. I... Oh my, fuck, I forgot that Tears of the Kingdom was coming out in like a month. Yeah, uh, what was it? I think it was 30 days... 34 days. 
Yeah. Like, fucking, like, I was gonna replay Breath of the Wild and, like, maybe do that on stream, uh, leading up to the... I mean, I, uh, there's the month until Tears of the Kingdom comes out, and it's like, oh... You can do that in, like, under 20 days. Yeah, but, I mean, with the way that I stream games, it's like, I, I wouldn't stream yeah. it very often. Oh, fuck. I wouldn't stream it very often, because I just don't stream often enough to finish, like, an entire game, and also have other games that I play as well. I'm happy I finished a, a couple of games, mainly, like, the Voodoo Vince is, like, the one I'm happy I finished on stream. Oh, damn. Which I, I still gotta finish Pokemon Legends Arceus at some point. Have you not finished it? No, I got to the, um... Uh... Was it the the Arcanine fight, which is like the third boss in the game? Oh, out of the seven, I, I want to say to a point. Oh, uh, shit! Oh god! Well, yeah, no. I finished Person of Three dancing. That I hated those streams. Oh, <laughs> why? That game is boring as fuck. Really? It's it, it, it's like unlike Persona Four. Uh, dance it. It's like you just do a bunch of dancing, then you get a social link, you know, sit through that, get some new requirements, repeat. Why even are the dancing games? Like, I, I don't know anything about them. They're rhythm games, obviously. It's like three and five have the same story. Uh, well, well four oh. is a proper original spin off with its own original story that fits into the timeline. Oh, right. Well, well, three and four, or three and five, are like the same story to a point where it's like, the 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 Velvet Room members of three and five saw the four team doing their shit and are like, all right, it was hold a contest, and whoever wins oh. wins, and that's the story. That's, that's it. the and story. It, <laughs> yeah, and like, a, a lot of it takes place at certain points within the story, like. Certain characters are not there at all. Uh, ma like main party members, I used to say. A and they're only there as DLC characters. Oh. oh. I'm. I'm speaking of Fisa, like, I got, um. 3 and 4 on Switch. Like, I literally, like, they're, they're like, right here. Like, I just got them the other day. And, I, I, gotta, uh, I gotta pick up 4 at some point. I just got them because, like, the, the, the bundle was on sale for, like, £25, and I already had, like, £6 on my account, so it was like, oh, need that's, like, 20 Yeah, it's like, I can't really buy 4 on my Switch, I have to do it on my PC situation, because I, I, I have my friend's Switch account hooked onto my account. Right. And, and he bought it, so it shows I purchased it on my account, but I didn't situation. So... What? Wait... So, <laughs> so, so if I removed, it, removed his account off of my Switch, it'd be like, oh, I'm able to buy it situation. It just shows it's already been purchased via a different account. Oh, right. So I have no, to go yeah, on my I PC and mean. buy it. Yeah, no, I, I, that is a thing that it does. I don't, um, this level is pissing me off. I don't like it. It's a fucking ghost house. I don't like it. Uh, I, I, I've been... What games have I wanted to stream recently? I'm, I'm trying to think. Uh, there were titles I wanted to stream. Oh, uh, some, some Mario stuff, mainly Yoshi's Island. Oh, yeah. Um, I mean, I don't know if I'm... I, I was thinking of doing a Mario 3D World stream, because that game is fun, but it's also like... It's probably best to play it multiplayer, but then, like, the Wii U version doesn't have online multiplayer, and the Switch version does, and I only have the Wii U version. The the, the Switch version is kind of worth it for all the, the extra doodads you get. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, I'd have to just buy the game again. It's yeah, like, it's, it's on sale at the moment. At the, oh yeah, no, it is. That's true. But, like, it's... I, I don't know. Yeah, what? Yeah, I started uh, Twilight Princess a couple of weeks ago. Like I think I think about a month ago at this point. Yeah, and oh man, is is that a video game of all time? Wait, what game? Uh, Twilight Princess. It's a what? Uh, is it, is it Twilight oh, Twilight Princess. Twilight Princess. Oh, right. I'm like, uh, that, that is such a video game of all time. I haven't actually played that game. 
I, I I had it on Wii back in the day, but I rage quit because motion controls suck. Oh. And I, I got stuck at like a one part in the game, and I'm like, I'm never playing this game ever again. Yeah, I'd be able to emulate it, but it's just like, I, 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 I don't know if I'd stream it or not. Uh, what other games do I have? Oh yeah, I also gotta finish Kirby, uh, Return to Dreamland. Or Kirby Wii, uh, I should say. Kirby of the Stars Wii. Yeah. I, I'm decently far in that game. Like, I'm I, close to the final world situation. I, uh, I'm not really, like, interested in playing any of the Kirby Switch games. The Switch Kirby games. The, the Kirby games that are on Switch. But, uh, I do want to play, like, Planet Robobot and stuff, because yeah, that's yeah. stuff, that's a thing. I, I would have. recommend checking out, uh... Forgotten Land, that's a really, actually, like, really good game. I have heard that that's really good, but, like, I, I, I just, I, I want to, like, play the other games first. Like, I, I can... Whenever, whenever the first Rhythm Heaven game comes on Switch, I want to play through that. I... Oh, yeah, because I'm probably gonna add that to this. Yeah, at least mainly in Japan. Yeah. Oh, yeah, fucking... It was streaming Rhythm Heaven. Oh, Rhythm, Rhythm Heaven Mega Mix, and I forgot that I was doing that. Uh, oh. Magical Note Box. Wait, uh, oh. The GVA version of this song sounds really janky. It's like the Seinfeld bass. Uh, that Seinfeld twin to it? Yeah. It's- no, it's just like literally like the same sound font, I swear. I, I can hear like the, the drums in it. Yeah. What's the oh, deal it? with Charlie Day? What's the deal with Chris Pratt? He goes, it's a me, I'm Garfield, and everybody loves him. Oh my fucking god, I forgot about the Garfield thing. He's literally, like, he's playing Mario, he, he played Mario, and now he's playing Garfield in, like, some upcoming movie. Yeah, which, honestly, that movie, from the concept art, looks really good. Yeah, I, I saw that, and it's like, yeah, it's because, like, it fucking, it's so annoying, right? Like, the, the, there's, like, good movies, like, movies that are animated really well, and, like, really fun, really good, and then Chris Pratt voices the main fucking character, and it's like, oh. At least... I, I I want Bill Murray to return as Garfield. <laughs> they should, despite they should, him, despite him hating that role. They should get. They, they should do what they did with um the Mario movie and get Bill Murray to voice his dad. I, <laughs> honestly, I, that'd be. Kind of cool. <laughs> <laughs> also, apparently, yeah, uh, Mario like parents are. Like actual Nintendo designs, they had sitting in a vault for a while. Really? Yeah. Shit. That's kind yeah, of funny. Should... They just like they they had no use for them until now. Yeah, especially like you know you could have used them in Yoshi's Island, Mario and Luigi partners in have... time. Oh shit. The fucking oh my god the fucking baby Mario scene in the Mario movie. It's like, uh, kinda, <laughs> kinda, got... kinda creepy. I can't believe Baby Luigi got bullied by Baby Jake Paul. Baby Jake Paul? Yeah, that, that kid looked like fucking Jake Paul. I thought it was meant to be Spike. Maybe, but like, the thing with Spike, he has black hair while uh, the bully has blonde hair. Yeah, well, I don't know. Oh. I mean, he's, I don't know. It's like, I mean, it, her, her his parents maybe yeah. may, parents maybe dyed his hair as a child. Who knows? I mean, like blonde hair can like turn into black hair. Like that—that's literally what has happened to me in real life. 
Like, I've dyed it blonde, but, like, at the root, it's, like, black. It's like, oh. I have a, I have very dark hair, so I'm, I, I, I don't know the experience. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it just, like, gets darker over time. But, uh, fucking, I've dyed it, so, uh, fuck you, Nintendo. You can't tell me what to do. I'm hoping I'm going to be able to stream most of the Splatfest, uh, not Splatfest, Splatoon event next week. Is there a Splatoon event next week? Yeah, for Salmon Run. Uh -oh. It's it's an extra thing they're doing instead of the big runs. But it's like, right. the, the final day, I have to leave to the, for, for the airport. Oh. <laughs> so it's like, alright, tell me we get like, at 8 in the morning, stream it for a bit, like, right, this should be good enough. I leave uh, to Toronto at like 2 p.m. my time. Ooh. Uh, I would say that I know people in that area, but also like I don't know actually. I, I know like one person in, in Toronto, I believe. I know like a kind of ridiculous amount of Canadians, which is to say more than one. Uh, a lot of the Canadians I know, uh, besides myself, are, like, not within my province. D oh. Yeah. I mean, that's Nobody wants to be here. Done. Not even me. I can relate to that. Like, the, the, the part of the UK that I'm, at, uh, that I'm living in right now is, like, absolutely just, like, it sucks. It's like, the, the province I live in is just boring as fuck. Yeah... My one isn't even like... It's like, kind of boring, but also it's just like, the people here suck. Like, I, I don't know, like, going outside and seeing the people around me, it's like, uh... I, I don't belong here, I don't think. Something, something isn't right. Uh... It, it's like... It's just all flatlands and farmers around here. Uh, I was gonna bring this up, like, at some point, I kinda forgot to. It's- I think you should play the Doctor Who DS game. Oh my fuck, okay, yeah, no, I- I watched the- the Good Fives gaming video about that. Fucking, it's a Professor Layton clone. It's yeah. just a Professor Layton clone. Like, I honestly think that would make for an interesting stream. Cause, like, what the fuck? <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> I, I want to play oh, was it? The, the, the Wii one John played, which is like kind of the same thing as the DS, or probably the same thing there. Isn't it like but, completely different and just worse? Yeah, but it's like it has that weird connection to itself uh, somehow. It's you like know, the, the, the story. I don't fucking, I don't even know. Have you even, have, have you ever watched Doctor Who? Uh, yeah, because a person like in school mm -hmm. liked it. Oh, okay. It, it's kind of as simple as that. It was, I like, the main thing I've watched was I, one of the anniversary specials they had in 2017? 16? 20... No, yeah, 2015. It was uh... David Tennant and the other doctor kind of meeting up Oh after. my god. Okay, motherfucker, that was 2013. <laughs> 2013? Yeah. <laughs> it's like five I, years I, ahead. I, yeah, I, I, you can see how much I, I, I did not turn. Yeah. I mean, I, I should have clued in because I was playing Pokemon X and Y at the time. Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, that was 2013. So, yeah. yeah um, that is very much like. I guess that's like a fine episode to watch if you've never seen Doctor Who, but it's also like an incredibly fan service y one. Yeah, so I I wasn't so, I, I I did not get a kick out of it. Yeah, <laughs> basically, um, and then they're doing that shit again now because they they've like recast him as the next like regeneration of yeah. Doctor Who, and it's like okay. I I love when the like the tenth Doctor is like the fiftieth Doctor. Yeah, no, it's like it's like uh, he's because he, he was in that special, and now he's the 14th Doctor, but then also the 15th Doctor was also announced, and it's gonna be, like, a special about, like, both of them. 
whatever. Like, the actual next one is not David Tennant, but he's gonna be there for, like, a few specials. Or something. I don't fucking know what they're doing. It's very silly. Neil Patrick Harris is the villain, I think. I, I wanna pick up the Switch game real bad. <laughs> uh, no, because, like, honestly, the fucking- the phone one, like, didn't sound that bad. Not- I, I mean, the phone one's gonna be fine. Yeah. Put the VR one turn. Yeah, no, the stinky oh. one. The stinky one. I'm kind of tempted. Maybe if they, like, go on sale, I could stream them. Because, like, honestly, that yeah. would be kind of interesting to talk about. How much does a physical go on Amazon UK? I should uh, check that out. I wouldn't get the physical for it. I don't think. <laughs> I don't know if it's worth that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, I, I do want to get a UK game from my collection at some point, since I don't have one. It would, yeah. it would be a good, like, symbol of UK video games, yeah. Uh, yeah, it, it, I, have, I have Japanese games. Oh. Uh, not, not, no European games. Yeah. So, oh, it's, it's oh. nine bucks? It's <laughs> or, nine or, uh, bucks? Nine parents? Wait, really? Wait, actually, what the fuck, I could just get this. Oh, oh hold on, <laughs> it's in the chat here. Wait, Doctor Who, uh, what the fuck is it called? Uh, duo bundle. Duo bundle. Uh, switch. Oh yeah, wow, it's, it's ten pounds. <laughs> it's from, <laughs> down from twenty-five. Oh, that is that is such a good price. That is like pathetic. I just oh god, I really give the show. That, is, that is that's crazy. It, you get one good. Him in a shitty game for free. <laughs> oh yeah, wow. The fuck? Oh, apparently it's been eight pounds before. Oh. According, according to Honey. Oh my god. Wow. I was Honey. You're saving money. Oh my god, you can you can get you can get top trumps with it, and it's fifteen pounds. <laughs> oh. They, they still do Doctor Who top trumps. <laughs> <They just> <laughs> fucking... <laughs> I mean, what, what, Top Trumps, I believe, is a popular game it, thing? Yeah, it's, I mean, it's not, it, I, I don't know if it's, like, a popular game thing, but it is a thing that we have that a lot of brands, like, license that stuff to. Yeah. So you get a lot of it, but it's like, I don't really know what it is, I don't care. Right, no, I forgot, the Doctor Who game also got a North American release. Oh, did it? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, and it's it's forty Canadian. I I think it in the European version, I think it's funnier and a slightly better deal. Yeah, I mean it's like much more accurate to the the Riley experience. Yeah, I, I can <laughs> I, I can I can get the John Cartwright experience. <laughs> the John Cartwright experience. <laughs> oh, that that is that is like uh, seventeen Canadian, which is like oh, that is a lot. What's when, like, it? To ship it? The, uh, the conversion to... Oh, the conversion. Uh, yeah. I should see how much it ships for. Uh, oh, I should check my local game store because they may have a copy. Oh. <laughs> Wait. Uh, library. Ooh. Um... I, I, if my library has it, <laughs> I, I don't have to spend a single dollar on it. Damn. You should, you should oh, stream they do. it. You should stream it and have me on as a guest so that I can tell you how fucking bogus it is. Dude, I'm, I'm trying to think it's like, the only time I'd be able to stream it is like next week, because uh, the week after oh. that, I'm on way for a work uh, thing. Oh, uh, right. Um, I'll, two of them. Whoa. I'll add this to my list, uh, and hopefully not forget about it because I'm gonna throw this into my pins. Right. Then. See, I could probably pick. I, I could probably get it soon. I could do it possibly tomorrow. Uh, maybe. Hmm. I don't even know. It, it's like, do I sacrifice a Twilight Princess stream next week for Doctor Who? The what stream? Uh, Twilight Princess. Oh, Twilight Princess. Yeah. I mean... I'd say so. Alright, it's on hold. I, I, put, a, I put a request in. 
So I'm gonna play Edge of Reality on the stream. Fucking Edge of Reality. It's just like, because like as someone who's like actually watched the show, like the premise of it is so like, like this is a, like this is an episode that they wrote that they didn't want to make into an actual episode, so they they just made it into a game instead, and it's like not very good. But it's like incredibly fan servicey because like the entire like series was for a little bit there. Okay, it seems like my local game store does have a copy of it. In. Oh. For how much? I don't know. They don't, don't list pricings on the site here. Wait, what the fuck? I'm just like dead. No, what? I fell into a pit and I can't get out. Like, huh? Uh, to wake up early. Uh... I'm just gonna rewind at this point. Honestly, I don't even like. I'm just gonna abuse the rewind function. Uh, where is my schedule I made for next week? <laughs> All right, like week's gonna be really funny because it's going Doctor Who, then Pokemon Stadium. <laughs> Oh yeah, I got the, 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 the They're adding Pokemon Stadium. If I forgot about that, but like they they haven't added the Game Boy games. So yeah, so I I wonder how good it's gonna be. Because the rental Pokemon in that game suck. Yeah, from, from like, what I hear. That's the thing that like people were worried about. Uh, yeah. I wonder if they would add the Game Boy games and then just have like cross compatibility. But... Yeah, I feel like it's gonna be. Uh, what is it? Kind of a surprise thing to be like, oh yeah, we're doing this. Because, I mean, like, they're also, like... Like, there's no other way of playing those games now. Like, the 3DS shop is shut down, and they're doing the, the yeah. Pokemon... What is the thing called? The, so, the sharing... Pokemon sharing service? Oh, Pokemon service. Home. Pokemon Home. Yeah, they're, they're doing Pokemon Home now instead of Pokemon Bank. Uh, so I feel like they would... It's like, I've been one of the stream generation, um, one and two recently, I've been thinking about it. Same as three. Ooh. I just gotta kind of get copies and a, uh, epilogue, which is epilogue. just like this. Oh. Yeah. So, so epilogues are just like a adapter for your game, board games for your PC. Oh. And these kind of emulate it situation. Just... So you can play your official <laughs> games on your PC. Okay, but... <laughs> I mean, you can just emulate the game, so I, I don't know. I, I mean, I think what's the epilogue is, like, you're able to save your saves and, like, move saves around the situation, which is, like, the cool thing about it. I suppose. And, it, and it's using, like, your official cart, too. Yeah. Uh, right, I gotta make a Doctor Who thing for my schedule oh my now. God. <laughs> Just have like a fucking like cardboard cut out of David Tennant. Uh, there it is. I'm I'm just gonna have to be up around the same time for <laughs> for for you to you like join in. I'm just. I oh, am yeah, usually stream pretty that... late. Yeah. Yeah, compared to. Oh. You. <laughs> uh. So yeah, it's. Uh, uh... I'm probably gonna wake up around this time, anyways. So yeah. Like an hour, hour, hour early, and I'll message you next week on uh, what was it? Tuesday. Tuesday. Um. Doctor. Is... Do what doctor should I use? Uh. uh just, oh, he's I don't know. Deep, he's deep in out. Where's a good image I can <laughs> use this one? See? Oh my god, what? What is it? What the fuck is it? <laughs> he, he just looks like he's, he's there. <laughs> it's just there. <laughs> there here in this one. Just, <laughs> the fuck? He looks so angry. <laughs> 
See, I'll use the one where he's just angry. I go, for, for anyone watching this, I, I can't show the images because I, I, I can't be bothered to like at the moment, but uh, basically it's 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 just stock images of David Tennant just looking very angrily and also walking, I guess. Uh, this is really hard, by the way. These levels are not easy. Oh shit, oh. What the fuck? Okay. Hurry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh god, this shit again. Wait, who thought this was okay? Uh, Miyamoto. You know, you're probably right. <laughs> you know, if I, I, I find it really funny uh, that, like, the, the movie, the Mario movie, like, at the start, it says that it's a Chris Melodandri and Shigeru Miyamoto production. But, like, what yeah. the fuck did they do? <laughs> like, they didn't animate the movie. <laughs> like, what? Because, like, at, at, at the end, like, the credit is producers, so it's like, okay, they're producers, but, like, they didn't direct it or anything, and yet they get, like, top billing, like, at the beginning of the movie, just for, like, working on it, just for being there. Uh... Yeah, that, that, that time works. Alright, dude. 2 p.m., which is like eight hour ago. Uh, alright. <laughs> <hour ago. laughs> what are you doing? My schedule for something. I'll put them in the chat here. You can oh. see it early. <laughs> the, oh my god. <laughs> Oh, okay, wait, 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 I'm gonna show this on the screen. Alright, I, like, I forgot the for the Splatoon logo uh, onto my Splatoon one now, I don't care. I'll oh, that later. Oh, but oh. it's still the same idea, still. <laughs> wait, uh, where uh, the image is, uh, where the heck is it? Oh. it it's just... <laughs> it's <laughs> He's fucking there. He's just so upset. He's so like he's so mad that he's in this Switch game <laughs> for like a couple minutes. <laughs> uh, so funny. He is the doctor. Uh, he is going to perform surgery. He's the doctor that who's. <laughs> So dumb. <laughs> yeah, I find it really funny that um, there was like a whole arc of the show where they were like obsessed with like saying what his name is, and then they never actually said what his name is. God damn. Yeah. Like they were like, oh my god, the doctor's first name or whatever. And it was like a whole like series of just like this like mystery, and then they didn't do anything about it. Like they didn't reveal it or anything. It was like who cares? Fuck you. I have Doctor Who on my list of images I made for my school. <laughs> <laughs> that, that is funny. Oh, do I throw my, out my schedule now? Why not? Oh my god, wait, oh my god, I actually made it to the end of the, the, the level. Oh my goodness. What do I have in my cart again on Amazon UK? Just uh, 12 I have Dragon copies. Quest. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Is there just like, 12 copies of Doctor Who The Edge of Reality for Nintendo Switch? The best, the best game. 
So if I if I was to import this, how much would this cost? Thirty. It would be ten dollars cheaper than buying the North American copy. <laughs> it's worth it, honestly. I I have I have all the money to buy it too. Oh my god. <laughs> You say that like you're gonna buy like eight copies. Uh, how much? Uh, ten plus. Uh, how, nine, 99 copies. I, I could have a limit of five per customer. <laughs> you could buy five copies of Doctor Who. They don't want too much Doctor Who around. <laughs> Remember, there's only f uh, f fifteen of them. I forgot how many there are. I, wait, I think it's 15. Maybe? Um... How many... Doctors? <laughs> how many doctors are there in the world? <laughs> At least two. <laughs> yeah, one and a half. Oh my god. Whoa. Okay, so like, there, there are 15, doc uh, 15 doctors. David Tennant's two of them. Yeah, David Tennant is two of them. He's actually neither of them. It cancels out. <laughs> I think there should be 10 uh, David Tennant's playing the doctors. I mean... You know what, they're gonna fucking- they're gonna do some, like, Marvel multiverse shit, probably, and there's- there's gonna be, like, ten of them. <laughs> I mean, you know, it's in his name. D yeah. They have ten, and then, like, there's gotta be ten of them. What- what new works has he done recently? Oh, uh, he was in Good Omens, which, like, still hasn't gotten a second season, but it's a really good, uh, series. He was in Chippendale Rescue Rangers. Fucking was he? <laughs> Scrooge McDuck! What's... Oh, oh, because he was in the TV show for that. The, the, the like, recent uh, mm. revival thing that they did. I've, I've, I've not watched uh, the DuckTales revival. Uh, David Tennant is in it. Um, he is in Family Guy. As the 10th Doctor, as he should. But, I mean, honestly, like, I can't blame him. That's, that's a good role. The Tenth Doctor in Family Guy. Uh, oh, for video games. Video games. He was in uh, Connect Sports Rivals. Wow. He was also in uh, Doctor Who: The Edge of Reality. <laughs> yeah, in, in Doctor Who: The Lonely Assassins. Uh, uh, as archive footage. What? <laughs> He's in Ark Survival, or yes, Survival Evolved. Really? And in Call of Duty World War Two. What? Why isn't? Wait, why is he in so many things? I never even like thought about this. Like, he's like a prolific actor, and he's in like fucking Connect Sports. <laughs> oh, he's in the TMNT 2015 reboot. Yeah. Oh, he's in Final Space. That's cool. Oh, I don't know that. It's actually in a lot of things, I didn't think about this. Yeah... Oh. I also- I, I, like, I, I don't know half of these, I don't watch television outside of- I mean, outside of the, the Japanese televisions, as they say. Uh, well, I mean, you know, uh, he does voice Bochi in Bochi the Rock. Oh shit. Yeah. Uh, Amazon Japan. <laughs> Doctor Who. <laughs> God, I wonder if there's like a fan base. Well, like I, I mean, there probably is a fan base for it in Japan, but like, I wonder what it's like. Like, I wonder what the like general perception of it is in in Japan. Yeah. Because like, how I... like it's a British TV show. Mm. I has not been. Dubbed over? Has it not? No, no it's only I mean, it seems like it's uh, only subbed. I mean, I can't imagine they would dub it because there's a lot of episodes. 
I mean, it hasn't stopped me from dubbing over other stuff. Oh no! They do sometimes do dubbed over stuff, huh? Oh. I assume that's for like special episodes. Yeah, like that, the, the current seasons or something. Oh, yeah, okay, that makes more sense. The current seasons. I mean, well, okay, I mean. There's been, because there's been like a whole thing with it where like the recent few seasons have like been absolutely fucking dog shit. Because the writers, the, the, or, like the main like showrunner for it is like really incompetent. Uh, mm. I don't even know what I'm doing. Uh, so recently they just kicked him out, and they're like completely overhauling it again. And they got like the the, the old guy back from when David Tennant was the tenth Doctor. So it's like they're kind of just like doing that, but again. But, but a lot of oh. the recent episodes just stink. Oh my. God. God, fucking so so the the, the Japanese voice voice actor for uh, David Tennant also plays Momotaro from Kamen Rider Deno. <laughs> which which you have no reference. I have a reference. Grab a gift. Oh my god! Know. Holy fuck! Okay, it's it's interesting you bring up um Kamen Rider because like fucking uh a lot of like I guess like uh earlier episodes of Doctor Who have a lot of like practical effects. Like a yeah. lot of like tokusatsu shit. It's it's not surprising. It's like essentially every episode of tokusatsu. <laughs> like they have like the monster of the week thing. I I should really check out eight episodes of Doctor Who at some point again after like a decade. <laughs> Wait, eight episodes specifically? Or just, just like, I'm, I'm planning to pick out a random uh, episode uh, to watch. I don't know yet. Oh, uh, I've, I've not watched a Doctor Who episode or anything within the past decade. There are a lot of good standalone episodes. Um, I don't really know which ones to recommend though, because they don't. Um... Yeah, fucking. <laughs> uh, yeah, the, the same Japanese voice actor for. Uh, David Tennant, or the Tenth Doctor, is also in Strangers of Paradise. What? Okay, that's amazing, as, 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 as the Warrior of Light. <laughs> it just seems like um, it is reused voices. I haven't played Stranger of Paradise, but uh, that's fucking amazing. Uh, I mean, the, the Warrior of Light is the main character from Final Fantasy 1. But, oh, right, okay. It's not he, the main he, character. He plays but... John Arbuckle! <laughs> Garfield show. That's incredible. Wait, so are you saying that John Ar John Arbuckle is the tenth Doctor in a roundabout way? I mean, I mean, David Tennant's middle name is John. <gasps> oh shit! We puzzled it. <laughs> <laughs> the secret revealed. John Arbuckle, the sixteenth Doctor. The sixteenth Doctor. No, he's been all of them this whole time. Yeah, Garfield is, uh, Odie's K9. Who plays Matt Smith uh, in Japanese? I think Matt Smith plays Matt Smith. <laughs> At least he sold those limes himself. <laughs> Actually, I think honestly, we were talking about David Tennant and stuff, but like, the, the stuff that Matt Smith has been in is like marginally more funny, because he was just straight up in fucking Morbius. Yeah, have sex. <laughs> Poop your pants, your pants. I, I kind of want to watch Morbius, but I'm like, uh, do I? No. Okay, okay, I, I, I'll, I'll say this. Uh, the only time I watched Morbius was like, on a 3DS with the audio turned off with a, a commentary over it from a streamer that I watch. And that is the only way I'll ever watch it, because it was really fucking boring despite the commentary. 
Like, even just... with the commentary, it was like, the, the, the movie itself was just fucking boring to watch. So, uh, the Japanese voice actor for Dave, uh, not Dave, Matt Smith, also is the narrator for Peppa Pig, in Japanese. Oh, that's really funny, because the actual narrator for Peppa Pig is in Tearaway. Which is a game that I really like. <laughs> this is oh god, so but that's also not smooth, but also holy fuck. My head is breaking apart. He's also in Pokemon. I mean everyone's in Pokemon. Uh, At least once. It... Oh, it's the okay. I I looked up this character, I'm like, oh yeah, now I remember. Really, like, not important, important character. Uh, Alright, He is Matt Smith, though. What, what games have Matt Smith been in? <laughs> Our uh, Doctor Who for the Wii. <laughs> I, I, I put a Math Smith. <laughs> <laughs> Math Smith. It's, it's only, only ever been Doctor Who games. That's really fucking funny, actually. Uh, movies. Yeah, not the Matt Smith hasn't been hasn't been in a lot of stuff. Yeah, he's been in Morbius though, which I mean, honestly, that's all he needs. He's also been Terminator Genesis. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I forgot about that. I, I, I guess this big thing was probably just Doctor Who. Yeah, it's it's a kind of a shame to say when like the height of your career is Doctor Who. I mean, he was also in Crown. I I, I think Crown's like a good show or something. I don't know. Oh, the Crown. Yeah. Right. I'm not British, so I I don't care. I don't. I mean, I haven't seen it, but uh, from what I've heard, it's like a pretty accurate drama retelling of the stuff and the things, but I literally don't even care about the royal family, like, not even in, like, a TV show format, so, like, yeah. I, I just, I don't care. Uh, I mean, like, I, I, I guess to a point, Canada is also the British to a point. I mean, it's no, it's we're, we heavily rely on the Queen for stuff. The Queen's she, dead. I mean, true, but like, <laughs> before that, it's like, she's on our $20 bill. Yeah, but, I mean, now she's dead, so... Yeah, good for her. Yeah, good for us. Honestly. <laughs> the world is better. <laughs> hey, have you seen Gangrum's new thumbnail? Yeah, yeah, no, you fucking sent it to me, or whatever, you showed it to Yeah. Me. I, I just gotta watch that episode and see their reaction to the queen being dead. Were they actually, like, a uh, 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 YouTuber facing at it? Yeah, the, uh, probably. I mean, the thumbnail is them doing the pogs and if, the, the Wojaks or whatnot. <laughs> the Wojaks. Uh, sorry, I mean, the Soyjaks. The... I, I believe it's what they call. Fucking, I don't even know anymore. I, I'm, I'm so updated on everything. It's not even being out of date, it's just that, like, it's, it's, it's really dumb. And then, and then it changes, like, every every other second. Yeah. Like, one day the Mario movie is good, and now it's... What? Hot to go, bitch. So, so Game Grumps is doing a, a... Another, like, live tour, but, like, now in Asia, so they're heading to Japan. What? Who is in Japan? Who is gonna like watch them perform? Well, they're also going to South Korea and Singapore, which like I, I can get Singapore, South Korea, eh, maybe. Yeah, like, I don't. Japan. It's very odd. Like they're not musical artists. Like they're they're like comedy people. Yeah. I don't know. Not to say like like I mean obviously there are people that speak English like everywhere, but. It's just all oh, it's I, I guess there's a market there, I don't I don't know.
Like, I swear to god, it's just literally the same field piece. Yeah, I've got games of playing Sonic Frontiers. Wait, what about Sonic Frontiers? And the game is playing Sonic Frontiers. Oh, they're playing it? Oh, no, no. And it took them seven episodes to get to the very first boss. Great. Aren't their episodes, like, super long now as well? Yeah. Oh, great. So, if, if this was, like, the original, like, original 10-minute format they, they were doing, this would have been, like, part 30 yeah, or something. Yeah, what the fuck? Ooh. Yo, I just fucking realized there wasn't a single thwomp in the movie. Yeah. Like, I'm kind of surprised at that. Like, now that I think about it, it's like, huh? Like, how? Like, Bob King Baban was there, I'm happy about that. Yeah. I don't know, the stuff that wasn't in the movie, like, whatever, I'm, I'm fine with it, I'm good with it. But it's just interesting to think about stuff that they didn't put in there, like, Probably intentionally, because like they have a scene where like Yoshi is invisible in the background, but then Yoshi isn't in the movie. You know, he's, he's a post-credit. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, he's a post-credit reveal. Like it's a fucking Marvel movie. Time to go back to listen to the Mario movie soundtrack on Spotify. <laughs> I, I I saw the um. Like, there was the, the fucking scene where they're, like, entering the, the Kong Kingdom or whatever. Yeah. The condom. And, uh, <sighs> the, like, Take On Me is playing, but, like, apparently, like, the original version of that scene had, like, original music playing. Uh, yeah, it was called Drive Me Bananas. Yeah, like, it, like that probably would have fit better, I don't know, like, it, it, it's just a, knowing it's a... that. <laughs> It's a really good remix and everything. Uh, I haven't listened to it, but like I'm probably going to because I like I can imagine like the 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 music in the movie was really good. Uh, like it, it it's like I think probably one of the best Donkey Kong songs like uh, ever at this uh, point. <laughs> fuck. It's, it, it, it's like besides like a TV show that that, that TV show is like peak. It's it's like it's a good mix of jingle like uh, jungle hijinks from like Smash and whatnot, but like, yeah. more modernized. Yeah, okay, the, 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 cause the scene where the fucking DK rap plays, uh, I, like, I, I saw people talking about that on, like, Twitter, and someone says, someone said that it sounded like, uh, the version from Melee, but, like, no the fuck it isn't. <laughs> what? Uh, my, my, my favorite artist from <laughs> Donkey Kong 64. Oh yeah, that as well, the, the David Wise. Not David Wise, the other guy. Uh, Grant, uh, Grant Koko. Grant Koko, yeah. Um, yeah, like that kind of sucks. Yeah, uh, I, I mean, like, it's, it's also like the 3D World. Bowser theme was also like from Super Mario 3D World. Yeah, like, I, I guess it's fine, but also like, it, it really seems like Grant Coco just didn't have any idea that it was even going to be in the movie. Yeah. Which is strange. Because, like, at least with 3D World, it's like there were people working on the movie that, like, worked on that game. So, like, it makes sense, but... I, I guess it comes down to he doesn't really own the music, and then Nintendo does. Yeah, I suppose. It's just like, why, like, why would you do that? It still sucks in the end. Yeah, because I mean, like, they don't own the music that they licensed, but they still used that stuff, so, like, huh? Oh, wait, no, I'm dumb. Wait, I mean, the, oh, shit. I mean, the other way. I don't know. I just. What is going on with this? Well, you're supposed to enter the pipe. I no, I came into the. Like there's something else over here. Oh yeah, okay. Uh, whoa. oh. 
I'm probably gonna uh dip out and like end the stream because I feel tired and I kind of just wanted to talk about the Mario movie on stream. Uh, <laughs> Seth Rogen, Donkey Kong goes. <laughs> Seth Rogen. Okay, fucking. Before I end the stream, though, uh, I thought the voice acting was fine. I, like, it wasn't like horrible, and Seth Rogen as Donkey Kong kind of actually works. Uh, I, I, but I he does. Donkey Kong would be so bad. He does do his signature Seth Rogen laugh, which is like very noticeable. He does it multiple times. He does it multiple times. Uh. But, you know, I don't know, it's, it's fine. I don't know, I didn't mind it, whatever. Uh, Donkey... Kong...